Hello, so we are back and this time we have a job which is coming from the, sh the the computer shop where I work for, yeah? So this job came with a broken hinge. Uh, you can see the hinge is very stiff, I mean, yeah, that can be a reason why this hinge get broken. But anyway, let's pay attention because this laptop has been here before. So check here, this laptop has been repaired in 20, 2021. With the hinge repair, and now you'll think, oh, sorry, your job just came back. Uh, you done a, a, I mean, you didn't do a bad job because last more than three months, which is the warranty time, but still, your job came back after two years. Now, if we are checking the laptop, and that's the interesting part, let me try to open. Now, let's have a look what job I did on this one, yeah? So check here. Actually, the broken hinge is the other one, the original one, not my one. Because I see, you, know, you see people uh, arguing about using hot glue on the hinge repairs. So that's my hinge, and that's the other hinge. Hmm? <laughs> Beautiful. I mean, my hinge is still good. And uh, you know what? Okay, this has like two years. The customer has nothing to complain. But I have customer coming back before and say, you fix the hinge and now it's broken again. And then I open and I show them, no, I fixed that one. And this one, which is broken, is the new one. So, you know, it's not my fault because the manufacturer is unfailed. But yeah, I'm just, you know, just a short note about using hot glue on hinge repairs. Yeah. Now, in order to fix this hinge, first check the laptop because you can have a surprise to have like a crack screen. But this one is good, yeah, it's coming on. Now the second, if you just uh, fix this hinge with hot glue, it will come back. I mean, this hinge is not even moving, you can see. It's very, very hard. So you have to uh, just weaken the, the hinge. That's very important. Because otherwise it will come back. You know what, I can't even open that screw. So what I'm going to use is a little bit of oil after run oil, you know, if you have nitro engines, this is good, you know, when uh, after you you run your RC toy, you can use that uh, oil. It's starting getting better, you see? Good. Now let's try to still lose that screw. Okay, that looks better. Let's see now. Huh? What do you think? Better, but I still want a little bit more. Okay, now definitely is better, yeah? So yeah, this is a good... Uh, uh, this seems to be okay. Now let's try to fix it like usual with hot glue. Now I did see people on the chat and say, sorry, you know, this works on the UK, but this is no way it will work on Australia. And yeah, I definitely understand that. Probably in a hot country, the hot glue solution, it will not work. Now the secret on using hot glue is you have to bring the hot glue uh, to a very high temperature, yeah? If you use like a gun, like a hot glue gun, it will not work. So we have to make the, the glue liquid. Don't worry if you'll drop on the screen, nothing it'll happen. Now be careful to not melt the screen or the plastics. This looks okay. At the moment, at the moment, yeah? 
at the moment is looking okay. Now you need a smaller nozzle on the hot air, like this one. And be sure you are hitting you are uh, hitting the metal for a good bond, yeah. Then at the end, remember you have to do a sandwich between the the plastic, uh, the bottom plastic and the top one. You have to do your sandwich. Be careful about the hot air angle. Perfect. Now it's time for the clamp, yeah? That's very important. We need a clamp. Perfect. Yeah, this is a solid one. Now here is another problem because the customer give us uh, what the customer gave us. This bit, we have to put this bit back. And I should uh, put it back before I stuck the hinge, but that's fine, it's not too late, even now. Perfect, now let's put the clamp back. All good, yeah? Let's wait. Let's wait a little bit, like 10, 10-15 uh, minutes and uh, check again. Meanwhile, let's be sure our sandwich is good here. Because I see the frame is coming out from the hot glue. Perfect. Clamp. Perfect. Now let's wait ten more minutes. Okay, so it's been it's been a while. Let's see, let's check. Let's see what we done. Huh? Perfect, huh? So what do you think? I mean, it's, it's, it's just perfect, it's like new. Our hinge is fixed, yeah? And everything looks fine. Mm -hmm. So what do you think about this? It will go probably another two years. Should go, right? I mean, it's hot glue. Testing if it's still working. Yeah, it's still working. Okay, good. I will stop here. I will say, you know, just uh, keep your mind open. Just remember, when you, you have a mechanical uh, bond, yeah? What do you want is to be flexible, yeah? This is a misunderstanding, exactly like in, the, in, a, in a car crash. Car crash, the more damaged car... That's actually a very good car because the car ate the shock. Okay, good. So same with the hinge, just having like kind of elastical uh, repair. It will uh, it will do better compared if you have like a hard uh, hard bond there. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, 
and uh, see you on the next one. Bye.